Alrighty guys, what's up? Doug Money with you. Doug Money Detecting, thanks for joining me and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be in an 1860s, uh, uh, 1870s ghost town and uh, I haven't been to this one yet. And I found it on the maps and uh, before it greens up I thought I'd get out here and dig this one. So let's see what we can get into. Thanks for joining me. See you at the next Good Tone. Alrighty guys, well, got a 1237 coming up on the e-track. I got my hole open and it should be right in here. I haven't looked at it yet. Oh, right there. What do we got here? A weedy or a uh, Indian? That thing is crusty. First signal, and it is a coin, but I don't know what we got. Let me clean this up, guys, and get right back with you. Stick around. It is cleaned up the best that I can get it out here, and I don't know what I have. This is, this site does date back to the 1860s, uh, maybe 1850s. So I, I don't know. I don't know what I have. It's an Indian. It's not a fatty. It could be a later Indian. If I get this cleaned up, guys, I definitely let you know. Stick around, guys. See you next. Good dough. Alrighty, guys. Well, down here in the hole, I got a 1245. It was 1336. It was pretty shallow. Um, you know, I think I got it right there. Is that what we got here? Dog tag, perhaps. I will, no, it's not a dog tag. Uh, 231. All right, well, let me clean this tag up, see if there's anything else on it, guys. Be right back with you. Okay, guys, there it is all cleaned up. There's nothing on the back and it's not silver. Obviously, you can see it's 231, so we're going to keep going here and uh, see what we can get into. But I'll tell you what, guys, it's, man, it's, the the, uh, the targets are pretty slim. So, stick around. I just wanted to take time here and show you where I'm digging. Uh, cellar hole there. Uh, I got another cellar hole right up there. And I've been working this area through here. And this is the type of stuff I'm digging right here. It's coming up, you know... Uh, 1134, 1136, 1245, 1244. You got to dig it, but oh man, guys, I'm just finding just a bunch of junk here. I'm going to give it about another hour and I think I might head out of here. So it's probably been at least an hour since I found that coin. So, all right, guys, see you at the next good tone. Right, well, down there in the hole coming up is a 1237, probably six inches down, seven. Uh, a little brass handle. That's what it looks like I got, you know, kind of like a little handle. You'd turn something. It's got some weight to it, but we'll keep going. Alrighty, guys, see you the next guys, one. I'm working up against this apple tree, and I haven't gone in there yet. And coming up as a 1243, 1240. Uh, I've got it right here in the hole. I haven't got it out yet. You can see it right, right here. Oh, jeez. No. Just a piece of junk. Looks like a radiator cap. That's what that looks like. An old one. Uh, man, I tell you what, this site is... I don't know. It's not turning out the way I thought it was going to, guys. All right. Stick around. See you at the next one. Next one will be a good target, I hope. I'll put her up on camera. If not... Probably gonna get out of here. See you guys. Well, coming up is a 1244, 1242. I just opened up the plug here and I'm gonna do a semi live dig here. 
Let's see if we can't find this thing. Okay, it's in here somewhere. Uh, right, right there. Looking through the camera, it's hard. Ooh, it's a button. Oh, look at the fancy on that one, huh? Yeah, it's got some. Looks like it's got some gold gild to it. Shank right there on the back. Very nice. Alrighty guys, we'll clean this up and see what's on the back of it. Stick around. Alrighty guys, well there it is. All cleaned up. And it's got a, some gold gild left on it. And I've been trying to clean up for about 10 minutes now. I cannot make out what that says. Uh, but if I flip it around here, I'm not sure what this is. But a very nice time period button for this for this town. All right, guys, see you in the next good tone. Well, guys, after about an hour hike out, uh, I'm almost to the truck. And that really wasn't much of a hunt, but that's just the way it goes when you, you know, when you metal detect. Uh, not a lot of good finds out there, but it was a ghost town that I wanted to check out for a long time now. And, you know, before it greens up, I wanted to get out there and do it. But, you know, that's, that's metal detecting, so... Guys, thanks again. Thanks for all the subs. Thanks for joining me. I appreciate it. Guys, we'll see you on the next one. And for Doug Money Detecting, I'm Doug Money. I'm out. All right, guys, real quick. Hey, I just want, I wanted to say I'm almost at 1,000 subs. And, uh, you know, I really appreciate that. So if you would, please hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment down below. Uh, I really like the uh, interaction with you guys. And every comment that you guys leave, I try to get back to you. Uh, sometimes in my inbox, I do everything on my iPhone and when I go to my inbox and then I click the inbox, sometimes your comments don't show up. So if I didn't comment or I didn't get back to you, that's why. But every comment you guys leave, I try to, you know, I try to get back right back to you. And, uh, so if you guys could hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Let's try to go to a thousand guys. Thanks.